Don't flag me. Oh man, almost got it. I'm gonna go for this. One. Oh, go for the Uno. I got you. Ah! Oh man. Here, right. replay, replay, man. Replay. Oh, uh, all right. No, replay. Yeah, replay. You can't. Yeah, I didn't hit it much. You're See? supposed to be good at this shooting stuff, man. Oh. All right. Oh, I can't I mess this so up. I'm so glad that they told us we should start shooting pool instead of shooting guns. Dude, I know. They're shooting pool things like something else, man. Whoa, oh, man. Come on. You I got the this. one. All right. Hey, 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 hey. Hold up. We got to play. We got to play fair. Play fair. Oh, uh, all right. Why'd you shoot at a strike? I'm sol You're solid. I'm, I was shooting for that four, but. I'm going to go for that three. I'm no good at this, hey, man. man. You're going to tear up the table, man. You're going to score it. Yeah, you know, I probably should chuck some chalk in my hand, too. Because I'm no good at this. Without chalk. That's what the problem is. It's, it's yeah. I don't have any chalk. Yeah. Well, yeah, they told us if we shoot pool, we got to have chalk. Chalk on the end of the. Try it again. Under the thing. Ready? Told you that's what the problem was. I couldn't even hit the ball before. They almost got two of them in. The chalk was. Alright, let's see. My turn. Yeah. Oh, where'd that thing at? Oh, dude. Oh, yeah. I got this three, man. Gotcha. Sucker! Oh, man. You need too much chalk. Too much chalk? Yeah. I don't, I don't think there is too much chalk. I tell you what, man, you need the blue, the, the red chalk. It's better. The red chalk, better, man. I got all the blue chalk. All right, give it a hey, try. Let me try that. I try that red chalk, man. That's stuff. I ain't gonna miss this one. Hey, hey, don't move the balls. I'll put it right back. I just gotta get plenty of that chalk up in there. Hold up. I think I got some something wrong, wrong with man. Hey, 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 making sure everything's chalked up. That. <laughs> Just keeping up everything. A little extra chalk for my pocket. Man, that red chalk feels slick, man. I like that. I'm so glad, man. So much more fun shooting shooting pool than shooting Hold on. You got a replay. I get a replay. Oh, man. That was close. What? I didn't sit down. I said I'm just oh. shooting pool. I said I almost got close. Hey, I'm going to go for this nine ball. All right. Hey, 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 buddy. Hey, hey. Hey, you do that, I get to do it with the three. <laughs> he told you those AKs don't work. Two can play that game. Hey, 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 hey. Welcome to another episode of Let's See What Happens. Thanks for coming. We got a fun video today. I'm going to outdo Demolition Ranch. If you've seen his video lately, uh, like a month ago, he did a video of shooting... Uh, uh, pool table to see if it would stop bullets, but he cheaped out and he got a wooden pool table But I'm not cheaping out on you Y'all are y'all are my subscribers. I'm not cheaping out. I got the real thing. This is made of slate I believe it has three layers of slate and uh, we're gonna see what happens They always said don't throw balls at the table, but can you throw bullets at the table? Let's see what happens All right, I got the table stood up and uh, we got it leaned up on center blocks I got Harrietta here to see what happens when we hit it uh, we're going to start with some pistol calibers and work our way up. I got some new ones for you today, so stay tuned. And uh, we're going to work our way up and see, could you hide under a pool table if somebody was shooting at you? Because why not? Let's see what happens. All right, we're going to start it out, and we are running out of daylight. Might have to finish this tomorrow, but we're going to start it out and move it up pretty quick. We're going to start with a 22 uh, long rifle out of a revolver, and then he's going to shoot a 22 long rifle out of a rifle, and we'll go down and see the damages. Let's see what happens. 22 long rifle out of a Heritage Rough Rider 22. All right, I think we have a hit. All right, let's go for go the 22 long rifle. rifle. This is out of a uh, lever action Henry. Hit. Do it. Two more. All right. Do I get? 
Oh yeah, that's pretty nice. Yeah, I like that, man. All right, let's take a look. That's good. All right, here we are. We've got uh, some damage right here. We got two shots right here that we the hit rifle. with the rifle, and uh, it scarred up the fabric, but it doesn't look like there's any damage, the best we can tell, to the slate. And then I shot a third one right down here, trying to hit these balls. Shot a little bit high on that one. Um, pretty close for a rifle to be shooting the iron sights like that. No, little again, just a little bit of a scratch on the fabric. No, our, no damage to the uh, this actual slate at all. Two revolvers right here, and I don't see any damage. Let's step it up. Let's step it up. All right, we're going with a Smith and Wesson SD9. Right, first, truly. That hit a little harder. All right. Well, we hit it with the nine. That did uh, a little bit more damage. Tore this all out. It 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 nicked it, but there is it wasn't going through. No way at all. Come closer didn't, and look at this. It didn't even crack it. Come closer. Go on, bring the camera closer. Let's take a look at this. Yeah, I didn't even. Uh, As you can see here, um, it's a little bit frayed, and, and you really can't tell. But it's 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 hardly even, hardly scarred, but definitely no cracks or any damage. All right, we're gonna go with the 38 Special out of a Taurus revolver. Let's see what happens. Did I hit it? Shoot another, shoot another one on the left. Just make sure we hit it. I'm gonna go right above Harrietta. I think so. I think you're hitting it. All right. Then he's gonna do a 45. What do you got there? This is a Springfield XD 45. Um, really nice subcompact 45 ACP. We're going to shoot this and uh, see what we got. That's a hit. That's a solid hit. All right. Then we're going to go with a 40 S&W out of a Ruger uh, P394. I'm going to go all the way to the right. And that's a hit. That's a hit. Cool. Let's walk down and see what we hit. All right, we got them here. A 38 Special didn't do much at all. It, it, it. Uh, I mean, you can feel a tiny dent, but it didn't even do anything to the fabric. Uh, we have our 45 was right here, and it didn't do much at all either. I can feel some chunks down here, though. I think it might be parts of bullets. Oh yeah, come in close here and look at this. We got pieces of jacket right there. So. It looks like the 45 did a nice, it, it, it damaged it, it just didn't yeah, tear it, the fabric back. It didn't do much. About the same as, uh, maybe about the same as the 9 in, in the amount of impact, though. All right, and let's look at the 40. Uh, I'm sorry, we're down here. 40 was right here, and it did some damage, but not a ton. Let's move it up to something bigger. All right, I got a Ruger Vaquero. Uh, Va Va it's, a, it's a Ruger Vaquero cowboy gun. Jaybird 44 Magnum. That's a big one. Let's see what happens. This one ought to pack a punch. Yeah. I yeah, that one that definitely one packs a punch. All right, cool. let's walk down and see what we did. All right, let's check this Dude, out. It went through. <laughs> Straight it through. over, folks. Thanks for watching. Let's That's see what all. happens and have it. No, it's not over. Hey, hey let's, let's talk about Kentucky butt lipsticks. Just stick a thumb in it. Right? Hey, this stood up to more than Demolition Ranch's trashy. Uh, trashy we get to call out. We get to call out Demolition Ranch and Kentucky butt lipsticks. Stick a thumb in it. All right, come around here and look at the back. Let's take a look. We chipped out quite a bit here, uh, made a mess. I do not see where the bullet went, but it did a lot of damage here. That is about an inch and a half thick. It's very, very thick. Um, I'm amazed that that went through. But let's step it up to a rifle or some shotguns and see what happens with those. We're going to do a 20 gauge. I've got bird shot, then double up buck, and then a three quarter ounce slug. And I'm gonna go from left to right and see what happens. That's bird shot. 
buckshot. Slug. Wow, that slug sure packed a punch. Yeah, I, I, I dare say that one went through. Yeah, that one looks kind of like it might have went through. Let's walk down and take a look. All right, that definitely, uh, let's look at the bird shot first. It is just peppered all over, but definitely didn't go through. And then the but same. a buckshot is just peppered all over. And it did some damage comparable like the 9 mil, I'd say. But it definitely didn't go through either. The slug, on the other hand. Straight through. Straight through. Man, that's a Kentucky butt lipstick hole where you stick both thumbs in it. Right? That did a lot more than even the 44 Magnum. It busted out a lot of the slate. Oh, we got damage up here. Impact damage from something, but didn't go through. Something hit it right there. Oh, that's from the uh, the 40. So it did damage to the back. All right, let's move it up to something bigger. I would say don't hide under the... Uh, ask ask whoever's going to shoot you what they got before they shoot you. Yeah, if a and robber's... And if it's bigger than a uh, robber magnum got... or a slug, uh, you're out of luck. But... Uh, yeah, if the robber has a like buckshot or birdshot, you should be all right. But a slug... Yeah, yeah I, I would try and stay to the other end of the table on that one. Good all right, idea. Go let's move it up. All right, and here we have a Browning 12-gauge shotgun. Probably some sort of a Belgium gun. Um, kind of an interesting 12-gauge semi-automatic. Um, we're going to go ahead and shoot this and see what we get. This is going to be 12-gauge buckshot. Go right dead center. Low. Woo, that hit hard. That one packs a punch, too. You can hear it hit it. It was a slug. That was a slug, my friend. I know. I thought you said it was a buckshot. No. Yeah, that was a slug. All right. I went straight through it. That was definitely a hard hit. Went right through just like I expected. Uh, but I wanted to do it anyway. All right. I got a Spanish uh, Mauser 1898 uh, Mauser. and 7mm Mauser. Let's go at it. Uh, I'm going to go toward the left. See what happens. I'm going to dare say that went through. Yep. That went through. I did not leave a very Dude. large... Uh, Hit the center, uh, no, it hit this board, and it, the board stopped it. So, you got somebody shooting that with you, 7 million or Mauser? Make sure the You'll support. hide under the pool table, and then make sure your head's right under one of the boards that's going across, because you might be okay then. Yeah, the support boards, man, that, that stopped it right there, so that works. You can see a bunch of powder from it, and it went through right there. Alrighty, let's... Let's do one more thing. We're going to take, uh, my, my brother's got an AK-47. I've got an AR, uh, AR-15. And we're just going to blast away at this thing, have some fun. And uh, we'll see if any of those go through. Let's do it. All right, got an AR-15, AK-47. Yeah, I have an AK-47. We're going to go at it. Uh, I've got some bad, not bad ammo, but it's. Uh, I'm having problems with it jamming, so I don't know how many shots I'll get in. But, but uh, the old AK will keep right on yeah, up. I ain't going to jam. Let's, uh, let's let her have it. Fire in the hole! And that's out for the AK. That went through. Alright, I think we hit it all over. I think we went through all over. We got holes everywhere. Yeah. I wouldn't recommend, uh, Hiding under a pool table if somebody's got a rifle. Anything smaller than that, handgun, other than a 44 Magnum, you might be okay. So my advice to you is just ask them what they got. And uh, if it's any bigger, ask them not to shoot you. That's probably your best bet. But we see what happens. We beat out Demolition Ranch. We got it to stop more than Demolition Ranch got it to stop. Thanks for watching. Let's see what happens. If you'd like to see more like it, subscribe. Let me know. And uh, we'll, we'll do more videos like this uh, as we come up with them. My next video, if, uh, leave it in the comments if you'd like, if you'd be interested in seeing this. I'm going to do a video on how to make a four wind shotgun. And uh, if any of you are interested in how to make a shotgun, let me know. If any of you are interested in being on a list with the ATF, come back and watch the video. Like the video, subscribe, comment, send it to everybody. Have a great day. You'll see me next time.